Now, hello again, everybody, and welcome back to Fujits Blitz. And this is a special video. This is just a showcase video of one game played by Fizzy11 of the clan GNA. Now, some of you may not know who Fizzy is. Fizzy is Discord God, basically. He is the person who effectively set up my Discord server and a lot of other people's Discord servers. And he is absolutely being invaluable in, in Discord. I mean, I'm a complete techno noob. And he does it off the, out the goodness of his heart. He, he doesn't do it for any reward. He, he, he is just generally helping everybody out. And the thing about Fizzy is I was on Aminet's Asia live stream Ascent Tour yesterday. And um, Fizzy mods as well for a lot of the uh, YouTubers' live streams. And Fizzy came, comes rolling in on the chat and says, Yay, I just got my first 7K game. And he was really, really chuffed and excited about it. And so he should be. And he kindly sent me the video replay. And I think it deserves to be looked at because it's his first 7K game. And okay, I did say on the live stream in the chat yesterday, Yeah, but if it's in a Sheridan, then it's meh. But I was only joking. I mean, I wish I could play the Sheridan this well. I can't. I hate the tank. I'm absolutely awful in it. Um, I just don't like it. But Fizzy deserves this recognition. He does so much behind the scenes for everybody. Um, and he really is an, a, hug, a, a unsung hero, as they say. So, let's sit back and enjoy Fizzy rolling out in his Sheridan yesterday on Canyon where he's going to absolutely wipe the floor with everyone. Now he's put himself into a great position here and he's already done 1600 damage, taken one kill. And as you notice, he hasn't actually been using missiles all the time. He's used a couple, some of them haven't worked, but he's put himself in a great little spot. Okay, so a lot of people have issues with these missile tanks. However, a lot of people say that they're broken this one I don't think is. Okay, the missiles are a pain in the backside, but this is not like the T-92, which is a completely different beast. I mean, this is a lot bigger, it, it, it's a lot taller, it's a lot longer, and it doesn't have that trolley frontal armor that the T-92 has. Okay, it's still a light tank, it's still got that light tank camo, etc, etc, and it's still got the same gun, but this is a tier 10. I mean, it's never going to face those tier 8s that the T-92 does. So, you know, this is not a similar tank. And I personally don't like the Sheridan. I'm, I'm not a good player in the Sheridan. I'm, I'm not good with the missiles. Um, I'm all fingers and thumbs. And I, I, I just don't get on with it. Um, and I haven't played it that much, to be fair. But, you know, it's, I was always interested to see how... Fizzy plays the tank. And as you can see, I mean, there you go, there. He gets the missile to hit the target, but it doesn't pen and it doesn't cause any damage. It does a knockdown. And I've noticed that he hasn't used a lot of missiles so far in this game. I think he uses, what, seven to nine missiles in total in the whole game? But that's the thing. I mean, the IS 8 there was a bit silly. They know that the Sheridan's around there somewhere. The IS 8 pushing down, was a bit, that was a bad move. He's got some tricky targets still out there, the E100 and the E4. The E4 is completely out of position because it's a hull down tank and he's almost side onto a Sheridan, allowing Fizzy to smack him with his APCR. But the, but the E4 is definitely after that um, E100 on, on Fizzy's team. It's four against two and you would have to say here that, yeah, no, Fizzy's team has got this quite easily. But like most games in Blitz, things change in turn. The E100 drops down. Fizzy gets smacked there by the E4, but he comes in and takes him out. Now it's three against one because they've lost their T62. Fizzy makes a good move here. He's using that mobility really well. He's, he needs to stop the points coming down on the base. And there is a reason for that because the E100 is still pretty healthy. And, you know, on Fizzy's team, they're going to push E100. And there we go. We've just lost the E100 of Fizzy's team. So it's two against one. Fizzy's taken four kills. The E75 is now going to come in to take on the E100. 
So this is why Fizzy needed to cap that base because it's gonna be a one-on-one -on -one scenario in a moment. The E75 is not looking good. He is gonna go down. He gets something into the E100, but not a lot. Fizzy thinks that maybe, oh, and there he goes, it's one-on-one. -on -one. Now this is where Fizzy gets a little bit lucky, I admit, because the E100 player is clearly not that experienced. Um, to be fair and to be honest he's in a bad position he's allowed the Sheridan to get above him he's moving into the open allowing Fizzy to drop missiles upon him whereas he would be better off capping the base onto the bridge that would make it a lot harder for Fizzy to drop these missiles on him he's now going to push towards Fizzy which again is a bad move by the E100 it just allows Fizzy to drop missiles on him willy-nilly. Now, I say he gets a bit lucky. Some people wouldn't do what Fizzy is doing. Um, I mean, Fizzy has put himself in a great position. And some people would think, oh, no, I'll just rush the E100 or whatever. Great game. 7,342 damage. Five kills. Bounces a shed load as well, to be fair. And I just think it's a fantastic game to get your first 7k damage in. I mean, it's not the easiest tank to play. Well, I don't think it is. It's a well-deserved mastery. And I did say the E100 on the other team was a bit inexperienced, but he still did 5.3 damage. I mean, that's a really good play as well in the E100. Unfortunately, he was just against Fizzy, who was playing the game of his life at the time. He was having a fantastic game. Anyway... That is been Fizzy rolling out in the Sheridan, getting his first 7k. Um, I've been Fujit. By all means, comment, like, and everything below. If you haven't yet pressed subscribe, please do so. It's a lovely thing to do. Costs you nothing. Puts a smile on my face. If you've got any some replays, wing them across to me. Fujitsblitz at gmail.com or post them to my Discord server, whichever is easier for you. And in the, you know, I'd like to do a big... Thank you to all my Patreons out there who, without their support, videos like this are a lot harder to do, to be perfectly honest with you. And until the next time, guys, stay safe out there. Please stay inside. Avoid unnecessary risks, unless, of course, you're playing Blitz. Have fun on the battlefield and happy tanking, because that is what it's all about. Staying safe, having fun, and being happy.